home uh, again after two road games. Um, two really big games for us obviously this week, um, hosting Kansas State and hosting in-state rival Drake who just beat Iowa State this week. Um, but Kansas State, you know, kind of gives us some bad memories from last year. We had the one point loss at their place. Uh, um, it was a situation where, you know, we had a lead and uh, we kind of let it escape us and they got to the free throw line a lot with that. So um, we're, we're anxious to play them again, um, but it is a, a very good team, obviously. And, you know, last year, Ayoka Lee was out with um, an injury, a knee injury. And so she's back and that makes a big difference for this team. I mean, she's almost six, seven. Um, she's a, a, you know, probably the, the, one of the tallest posts that we'll go against all year long. And uh, we have to be ready for her. And uh, they also have some decent three point shooters that, you know, open things up for her. So um, Kansas State, good team receiving both votes in both polls. And we know we'll have a battle on our hands. Sydney, what's with your rebounding right now? You're leading the team in rebounding. You had 14 against Virginia Tech. Uh, what's, uh, you know, have you been such a, such a monster on the boards? Yeah, I mean, I think that was really an emphasis this year. And with McKenna and Monica leaving, I knew that was going to be really important um, within my role. So I just want to take advantage of that whenever I'm on the floor. And I just think rebounding is just a, a lot about hustle. Just get in, get after it. Um, so. When you have a player like Kaylin, and even if you didn't, how <laughs> important is it extending those possessions with offensive rebounds and getting her the ball back and being able to you know, operate that way? Yeah, I think we always talk about um, extra possessions and getting offensive rebounds is the way to do that. And Kaylin's going to take a lot of shots, and I think we all know a lot of them go in. Um, but the off chance that it doesn't, um, I want to be there to get the rebound. And, have an extra chance to get another two or three point shot. What do you guys remember about the Kansas State game? Kyla, obviously you didn't get to play last year, but what do you guys remember about last year's Kansas State game? Um, I remember they had some good, really good guards. Um, Gabby Gregory, she's really phenomenal. Um, so I think that'll be really important for us to shut her down um, this year. She drew a lot of fouls on us last year. Um, so I think make sure we get after it defensively and be careful um, fouling wise. But I think like coach said, Ioka Lee, um, she's a great post and guarding her and getting box outs, rebounds is really important for this game. Kylie, how much comfortable do you feel even, you know, three games ago, just coming back and getting in the flow of things? Yeah, I think going back into it, I mean, it's kind of like a work in progress. You kind of have to get in the flow of things and get comfortable again. But um, I'd, I'd say even just within the past three games, I've just felt more and more comfortable and um, just kind of knowing what I need to do in whatever game. And um, I mean, it feels good to be back on the floor, but obviously, it's, like I said, it's a work in progress. But. How did that feel there at Virginia Tech, that one quarter yeah. where you just sort of took over? Yeah, um, it's one of those where I think I kind of like black out. Like, I just, like I'm in the zone kind of, so like I, I don't remember it too much. Um, but it felt really good. I think looking back at it, um, it was nice to know that like I kind of was able to come back from where I kind of left. Um, but yeah, it was just a really exciting game, and um, I was happy to do whatever I needed to um, with our team. And we had some people in foul trouble, so just being able to kind of maximize on whatever they're when they were able to be on the floor. Did you have a sense of confidence, like I am back? Yeah, I think when Coach Witter called like one of the like the, one of our plays. Um, and then when she called it again, like that was kind of when I got like that momentum. And um, after that kind of and one foul, that was kind of when I started to feel really into the flow of things. Sydney, we've talked about um, you know the the November stretch that you guys have and how it's tough, and you you guys have really jumped right into it. How much has that helped keep everybody locked in? On top of you know what you guys already have as expectations, just the fact that. You know, it, it seems like it's one good team after another here to start. Yeah, I think we have a, a long stretch coming up, a lot of tough games um, with Kansas State Thursday and Drake Sunday. They're both really great teams. And I just think we always talk about um, taking it one game at a time. We're not looking at like the end destination. We're um, working on the journey and the process. And I think that's really important for us. Um, after one game, we move on, win or lose. Um, we got to move on to the next game. Jeanette, what, what do you think about when there's when there's you 
guys are on offense and you're and you're sort of roaming around and everything and then all of a sudden the shot goes up. What what's your first instinct? Go get it. Go get it, <laughs> yeah. Um I think that I'm gonna be the first one to the ball every single time and I think having that mentality helps a lot with rebounding. Um, I don't think anyone else is gonna get it but me. So. Well you noted 